on what is up guys this is Expo and I'm back with another video so today in this video I'm going to show you how you can max your refresh rate with the help of term marks and the script files and guys I suggest you to watch full video to avoid any kind of mistakes because if you'll do some mistake then it may not work on your Android devices and guys I want to tell you one more thing that uh, if you have installed term marks from Play Store then delete that version because that is limited version and my script will not work in that versions okay so download latest version of termux from my links so guys without any further delay let's get start the video so guys first of all download the file from my link i know you have already downloaded the file because you are pro in download after download extract the file and here you can see the refresh rate script file and another is termux app so first what you need to do is simply copy this refresh rate script files and paste in internal memory because guys when you keep this file in another folder then you have to add more commands in termux app to make it easy simply keep this file in the internal memory and my command should be same for all viewers so simply copy this file go to internal storage and simply paste here and after pasting go to extracted folder and install the termux app and guys make sure your device is connected with wi-fi or data okay so now termux is installed successfully now simply open this app and here we have to add the commands so watch carefully because every step is important okay so, so now type here termux hyphen setup hyphen storage and allow the storage permission and here type another command and that is apt update and again hit the enter button and it will take few seconds to execute the command after this add another command apt space upgrade again hit the enter button and here it will ask you for yes or no so simply type y and hit the enter button so guys whenever it will ask you to type yes or no so simply you have to type y and hit the enter button so guys our file is installing through the termux so please wait will take few minutes so i will fast forward this process and i will meet you after complete this process after this again add one more command command is apt space install git space and hit the enter button and now we are in last command so simply type apt space install space python space and hit the enter button and here it will again ask you to type yes or no so simply type yes and enter button okay so our file is installed successfully in term so now it's time to flash our script files so here add the commands so here simply add commands pwd and hit the enter button okay and now here we have to add another command so simply type cd space slash storage slash emulated slash zero slash and hit the enter button now here type p y t h o n python space and what you have to do is we have to copy the file name this name okay raise so this is the file so simply copy the name all the text and go to termux app and paste here okay after pasting hit the enter button and as you can see our script file is opened successfully and here you have 
to select your device RAM and here you can see enter your RAM size so here you have to type your device RAM size so simply add your device RAM size after adding your device RAM size simply hit the enter button and it will start execute all the script files so please wait it will may take few seconds to execute the files So guys, as you can see, the file is flashed successfully. Now it's time to select refresh rate. You can use 60 hertz to 120 hertz refresh rate on your Android device. So here, simply type refresh rate and hit the enter button, and it will again start execute the script file. So guys our file is flashed successfully now simply type exit to close the termux app and now you have to reboot or restart to re-execute all the files so after reboot you will feel the real smoothness of your device and you will feel the better smoothness than before and guys most of the user don't know about difference between refresh rate and the APS guys refresh rate and APS are different things and if you want to know more about this you can google it or you can watch videos on on youtube so guys i hope you like this video and if my videos are helpful then don't forget to like this video for more amazing termux tweaks and guys that's all for today see you next video till then take care and signing out